Hello, my sweet friends, and happy Tuesday night. Have you had a very good day? Miss Nicole has had a very good day, and I wanted to end my very good Tuesday in a very good way, and I thought the best way to do that was to spend some time with you and hear a wonderful bedtime story. So welcome to Bedtime Stories and Prayers. So sometimes when Miss Nicole picks out her stories to read, sometimes she wants one with a certain message, and then sometimes she picks one that has really cool pictures, and sometimes she picks one by a certain author because she heard a really good thing about it. But tonight I picked my story for a different reason. Well, for two reasons, actually. The number one reason, as always, is because it tells us a story about God and his word and things that happened in the Bible. But tonight, you know what I decided? My number two reason? I just wanted a fun story to read. One that would make us laugh. Maybe even a little bit silly, but definitely fun. And I think I found a really good one. Are you ready? This story is all about our friend Noah. Remember Noah in the Bible with all the animals on the ark? and about the ark that he built. And I'm gonna hold it down and read and then show you the pictures as we go, because I think you need to see them. This is the ark that Noah built. And this is the grain that was stored in the ark that Noah built. And these are the rats that nibbled the grain that was stored in the ark that Noah built. And these are the cats that chased the rats that nibbled the grain that was stored in the ark that Noah built. And these are the dogs that growled at the cats that chased the rats, that nibbled the grain that was stored in the ark that Noah built. And these are the tigers with razor sharp claws that frightened the dogs that growled at the cats, that chased the rats, that nibbled the grain that was stored in the ark that Noah built. And these are the alligators with wide open jaws that snapped at the tigers with razor sharp claws that frightened the dogs that growled at the cats that chased the rats that nibbled the grain that was stored in the ark that Noah built. And these are the monkeys with shrieking cries that teased the alligators with wide open jaws that snapped at the tigers with razor sharp claws that frightened the dogs that growled at the cats that chased the rats that nibbled the grain that was stored in the ark that Noah built. And these, ooh, are the snakes with hypnotic eyes that charm the monkeys with shrieking cries that teased the alligators with wide open jaws, that snapped at the tigers with razor sharp claws, that frightened the dogs, that growled at the cats, that chased the rats, that nibbled the grain, that was stored in the ark that Noah built. And these are the elephants with the stomping feet that scattered the snakes with hypnotic eyes that charmed the monkeys with shrieking cries, that teased the alligators with wide open jaws, that snapped at the tigers with razor sharp claws, that frightened the dog, that growled at the cats, that chased the rats, that nibbled the grain that was stored in the ark that Noah built. These are the bees that were robbed of their treat, that stung the elephants with the stomping feet, that scattered the snakes with the hypnotic eyes, that charmed the monkeys with shrieking cries, 
that teased the alligators with wide open jaws, that snapped at the tigers with razor sharp claws, that frightened the dogs, that growled at the cats, that chased the rats, that nibbled the grain that was stored in the ark that Noah built. These are the bears that ate all the honey that angered the bees that were robbed of their treat that stung the elephants with the stomping feet that scattered the snakes with hypnotic eyes that charmed the monkeys with shrieking cries that teased the alligators with wide open jaws that snapped at the tigers with razor sharp claws that frightened the dogs that growled at the cats that chased the rats that nibbled the grain that was stored in the ark that Noah built. These are the hyenas that thought it was funny, that laughed at the bears, that ate all the honey, that angered the bees, that were robbed of their treat, that stoned the elephants with the stomping feet, that scattered the snakes with hypnotic eyes, that charmed the monkeys with shrieking cries, that teased the alligators with wide open jaws, that snapped at the tigers with razor sharp claws, that frightened the dogs, that growled at the cats, that chased the rats, that nibbled the grain, that was stored in the ark that Noah built. This story's getting a little wild, isn't it? What is going on down here? Guess who that is? This is Noah who yelled so loud, who quieted the hyenas that thought it was funny, that laughed at the bears, that ate all the honey, that angered the bees that were robbed of their treat, that stung the elephants with the stomping feet, that scattered the snakes with their hypnotic eyes, that charmed the monkeys with shrieking cries, that teased the alligators with wide open jaws, that snapped at the tigers with razor sharp claws, that frightened the dogs, that growled at the cats, that chased the rats, that nibbled the grain, that was stored in the ark that Noah built. And this, this is the dove that broke through the cloud sent by Noah, who yelled so loud, who quieted the hyenas that thought it was funny, that laughed at the bears that ate all the honey that angered the bees that were robbed of their treat, that stung the elephants with the stomping feet, that scattered the snakes with their hypnotic eyes, that charmed the monkeys with shrieking cries, that teased the alligators with wide open jaws, that snapped at the tigers with razor sharp claws, that frightened the dogs, that worried the cats, that chased the rats, that nibbled the grain, that was stored in the ark that Noah built. And after that, guess what there was? A rainbow. And this is what that rainbow meant. And the, this is God's promise to you and to me. Written by rainbow and twig of a tree. A promise to lead us and guide us always. To love and protect us the rest of our days. The end. Isn't that a cool story? So the flood was coming, as we know from the Bible, and God told Noah to build an ark and to put all these things on the ark. And all these things normally didn't stay together. So there was probably a little wildness going on on that ark. But God said it's what Noah needed to do. And Noah was faithful, and he did it. And even though it was probably a little wild on that ark, eventually the flood was gone. And God sent the rainbow, and that was the promise to us that he would always protect us and always be with us, no matter what kind of wildness and crazy may ensue. So I hope we remember that this week. I'm super excited that we got to read a super fun story this week and learn a good lesson too. And I hope you enjoyed it a lot. So how about we close our eyes and bow our heads and say our bedtime prayers together. Are you ready? I'm ready. Let's close those eyes and bow those heads. Dear God, we are so thankful 
that you always take care of us. Whether it's from a flood or whether it's from some craziness in the world or times we're scared or times things are changing and we don't know what to do, you, God, promised to always protect us. And we know, God, that you always keep your promises. So as we lay down to sleep tonight, let that make us feel so good and so thankful in our hearts. Help us have a wonderful night's sleep and a wonderful week. And thank you, God, for always being with us no matter what. And please help us remind us every day that you truly are. It's in your son Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I'll see you guys next time. Sleep so good. I love you so very much. And I'll see you next time.